like Dylan Dillinger, hot like fire. to my channel in today's video I'm gonna be bringing to you my gift guide for her now I also did one for him so I'll link that down below and I'm gonna try not to have these include all things that I want because that's not what this is about I love doing these gift guides to think of different types of women and different things that all different types of women or feminine presenting people would enjoy so if you're looking for the perfect gift for her then keep watching okay so first on my list is going to be Brooklyn linen sheets I spoke about this in my gift guide for him because I feel like the perfect gifts to give are things that people love things that people really really need or items that are a little high priced that the person wouldn't necessarily spend their money on like myself I like to do this but I'm not buying hundred dollar sheets I'm just it's not practical to me, so I wouldn't do it. But those are great items to give. And I have been hearing everybody talk about Brooklyn and sheets. So if the person you're buying for is redoing their room, or maybe they just love home decor and things of the sort, or maybe they're a homebody and they love being in bed, definitely check out Brooklyn and sheets. Brooklyn and also sells towels and robes and so many other things, pillows and throws. So check out the website. You'll probably find something for the luxury home lover. Next on my list, in the same category is going to be Cozy Earth. I believe this was in Oprah's, um, my what is it called? Oprah's Favorite Things One Year. But I have heard that Cozy Earth pajamas are some of the softest ever. Now I love a good modal blend pajama or robe. So I will have to check these out for myself. But I would say either a robe or a nice pajama set. Once again, very pricey, but supposedly very, very soft. <laughs> I hear nothing but great things about Cozy Earth. Um, I do believe Brooke Lennon maybe sells robes, but I have heard through the grapevine that Cozy Earth's clothes are a lot cozier. But if that's out of your price range, I will definitely leave two other options down below. Nordstrom has a line of really soft modal pajamas, Victoria's Secret does as well, and even Target. So I'll leave three options below for you. Gifting pajamas or robes or caftans, you cannot go wrong with that because who doesn't want to be comfy and cozy? Like, I know I wanna be. <laughs> and speaking of which, my next item is a Notori Caftan. And if you guys follow me on Instagram or have been watching me on YouTube for years, you know that I love Notori. They feature straight sizes and plus sizes and their fabrics are so comfortable. They have everything from fleece to satin to silk to polyester, caftans, robes, gowns, I mean, pajamas, lingerie, everything. You cannot go wrong with Notori. Notori is kind of East meets West so the styles are very Asian inspired and influenced and I love it. It's definitely my go-to brand when I want something that's printed. You know sometimes I just want to be basic and boring not in a bad way of course but Notori's prints are just so fabulous and if you're looking for something luxurious and really really pretty something exquisite Notori is the way to go. My next item is very very practical. In the same category though these are the Stars and Stripes slippers from Target. Now I have two or three pairs of these. Recently, they just came out with a collection of really colorful ones and they're $10. Now y'all know I like my Ugg slippers, but you know, I live in Atlanta. So one day it might be 40 degrees and the next day it might be 70. So I like to have enclosed slippers and slippers that I can just slide in where my feet are out so I won't get too hot. These Target slippers for $10 are amazing. Now they do run large, so I take mine in a medium I wear a size nine and a half to ten but I can fit a medium they fit well they're so comfy cozy high quality and only ten dollars they're perfect and if you want something a little more high quality and durable definitely check out the Ugg Scuffet slippers I always keep a pair of those because they're so cozy and warm and they're a little pricey so it makes a great gift the next item is going to be a custom candle 
Now I see these all over Instagram and I just think they're so cute. You can get them customized for people's birthdays, their zodiac sign, anything like that. Who wouldn't want a nice candle? I mean, I know a lot of us, we love our candles and sometimes we like them from Target, Bath and Body Works or Diptyque, but sometimes you want something that's more sentimental, that means something to you. And I love those candles. So I will definitely link a website down below where you can get customized candles, something just a little different for the candle lover in your life. And if you know someone who's a candle lover who wants to get into more high priced candles, I would suggest the Diptyque Bay candle. That is, I think, the luxury starter candle because it tells you what scents people like. Diptyque Bay, B-A-I-E-S, is a very androgynous berry scent. It can kind of steer you in a way of, do you like more fresh scents, more woodsy scents? But it's very, very androgynous and very strong. It's also like a $70 candle so it makes a great gift they also have them in varying sizes and intensities and room sprays and car scents and everything of the sort but if the person that you're buying for loves everything home or luxury this is a great gift my next gift is going to be a luxury mug or tea set if the person you're buying for is like myself and loves to indulge in China and all your tea and coffee accoutrements they will love this everybody is coming out with luxury tea sets which I enjoy. Now you can get them from Tiffany, Versace, Vera Wang. I think Dior has recently come out with some. Literally every brand is now making teacups and mugs because people are wanting to include that luxury in their everyday life. Hermes has some. This is the perfect gift for your luxury lover who also loves homeware and tableware. Just exquisite. Bring luxury into your everyday life. It doesn't always have to be about a bag or a shoe. I love a little sprinkle here in there. The next items that I want to talk about, jewelry, like a whole jewelry line. It's called Bico, I believe. It's actually a Canadian jewelry line. I was put onto it by my friend Kendra and she actually bought me um, a pair of earrings last year from the line, which I love so much. But Bico has really, really exquisite jewelry pieces that are a bit more unique. I am trying to get into jewelry, but I will be honest that I'm very basic in what I like, but I love Bico pieces because they're still simplistic, elegant, but they have something a little interesting about them. Uh, check out the website, I'll link it down below. I love their pieces. They make a statement without doing too much, and I think they're kind of mid-range in terms of pricing. You can get a lot from about $75 to $150, so definitely check out Bico jewelry. Next is going to be for the traveler. Maybe she travels for work or leisure, and it is Bay. <laughs> Is it called Bay? travel gear. So once again, my friend Kendra has this. Also, my girl Chelsea Jackson on YouTube has this collection. I want to say it's called Bay. But their travel gear is so cute and also functional. Now, I'm not someone who's really into like um, zippered compartment pieces and hanging jewelry cases or toiletry cases and those little compartments like packing cubes. I'm not too much into that, maybe one day, but Bay is a great line. Is it called Bay? Bay's? Bay? I, something like that. But this is a great line for the traveler. The pieces are chic and beautiful and also really interesting organizational pieces. So check out their line. If the woman or person you're buying for loves to travel, you cannot go wrong with Bay. Bay's something like that. Next is going to be this Lululemon fuzzy fanny pack that I saw on my girl's Instagram. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. It's basically like teddy coat fabric on a fanny pack. If you're buying for a college student, a mom on the go, an influencer, a vlogger, anything of the sort, anyone who loves fashion-y items but is also very practical, this would be a great item because who doesn't love a fanny pack? I usually don't wear them in the winter, but maybe something like this would get me into it. So I'm definitely going to probably add that to my Christmas list just because it's so cool and it looks comfy and cozy, and tis the season. <laughs> Next is going to be the Sephora Fragrance Sampler. This is a great gift set for her. I always, always, always talk about this in every gift guide and every Sephora recommendations because it's the gift of someone else choosing. So you present them with this gift set and it includes maybe seven to 10 sample fragrance vials. They get to pick which scent they love and then there's a certificate for them to redeem it for whatever fragrance they love. So this is great because 
because you don't have to know specifically what they love. Or if you know that they have a favorite fragrance and it's in the box, buy them the box anyway because it might be a little cheaper. And now they get to try out a plethora of fragrances. This is such a great gift because oftentimes when you go in a store, the sales representative might not really be intentionally listening. They might just be trying to push something because they're in an event. So this is more of a low to no pressured environment. The person gets to choose their fragrances as they please. And in the end, they end up with the perfect fragrance for them. The next item on my list, Brandon Blackwood. So I actually have a few Brandon Blackwood bags on my wish list or possibly just have my eye on. Brandon Blackwood is a brand that I haven't gotten too much into because I believe when he first came out, he just had the trunk style bag and I keep vacillating whether or not I want a trunk style bag but he recently dropped a new collection and when I tell you these bags are hot like fire like Dylan Dillinger hot like fire if you know you know his new pieces are so exquisite if you're buying for a bag lover and you want to get them a piece of luxury from a black owned brand this is perfect he has every type of bag from career woman to teen to mom everything in between oh my gosh the pieces are so unique and beautiful he's also black and asian i want to say so shout out to um the japanese girls or the blasians <laughs> i love that for us but his bags are definitely beautiful and i do like some of his styles so definitely check out brandon blackwood you cannot go wrong with them one of my faves here on youtube lavishly chi chi she has done so many brand and Blackwood videos so I will link some of her videos down below to help you decide what to buy. Now this is going to be for the luxury beauty lover. I want to say I saw this on Instagram months ago but it's like a YSL lipstick mixer and I want to say it's like either $200 or $800. I mean, that's a huge discrepancy like a huge range. I can't remember the price, but I do remember it being out of my budget, what I would pay, either one. Um, but it's a great way that you can get a custom lipstick shade. So if the person you're buying for loves beauty and loves luxury or just cute little gadgets that are very unique, definitely look into something like this. I think it's such a cool piece. Um, I've never seen this in any other luxury brand. So yeah, for sure, check that out. The Luxury YSL Lipstick Mix. And last but not least for the luxury lover as well, I always say a new wallet or card case and right now my favorite is the YSL, um, the signature zip top case but that also has the card slots on it. I have that in a really pretty like greenish blue color. If you don't want to delve into buying someone a bag, a card case or wallet is so nice because they still get something new and something that they'll use very often and I think it's a nice way to be able to try your hand at different brands or colors or leathers. I would recommend the YSL zip top card case because mine is durable, the leather is very nice, the zipper is smooth, the color is beautiful, and I've had absolutely no problems with it. So guys, that's all I have to share in my gift guide for her for 2022. Leave down below your best gift ideas because I'm still Christmas shopping and I'm still building my Christmas list. So I would love to know what are some of the hottest things that you guys are loving. Once again, I try not to include anything that I want or things that I'm getting for other people in case they watch these videos. <laughs> I love you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, I will leave the gift guide for him linked down below. And I will see you guys in Vlogmas. Bye, guys.